Welcome back to my channel where we talk about things on the internet that I find amusing and wish to share with you all. Conventions come in all shapes and sizes and let you embrace the things you have a true passion for amongst others with that same passion. Some people like to really quote unquote get into character and by that of course I mean cosplay. Not only am I not a cosplayer, I actually have never been to any convention ever in my life. However, I still have a big respect and interest in both conventions and cosplay. I personally really like Overwatch, and on their subreddit, I'm constantly blown away with some of the cosplay done by the community. People really work hard on their costumes, and it must be a very stressful situation when they have a wardrobe malfunction. Well, for most conventions, you won't have to worry about that, because the cosplay medic has your back. Let's meet Wayne Doe. My right arm here needs to be here, and he came off here. And do you have a wipe or something? Yes, I do. Awesome, thank you. I got my uh, armors ripping off, and someone lent me the sewing kit. And that is actually inspired me to do to be cosplay medic for the con after that. I can go up and meet you, okay? How long you want it and go on uh, to? Just to, like, it's sort of vain, like, down to there. Okay, to see their smile of relief when they see that they can continue to have fun on, on the con floor and to uh, show off the cosplay, it, it's, it's really nice. It I cannot good. explain it, but it feels nice to have people. Yeah. I mean, I guess it's a Canadian thing to say. Yeah. There's so many talented people with such amazing artistic uh, skill, and they apply the, the, those skills into beautiful things. And it's great to see a favorite character come to life. Yeah, so basically this dude is the emergency repair kit for cosplay. Everything about this dude is awesome. He has a genuine passion for cosplayers and wants to enable their artistic vision. Not only does he offer a wonderful service, but it's also free. He's from Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada and has a Facebook page where I tried to reach out to him earlier this week for an interview. However, as of right now, he hasn't got back to me. His page also hasn't been active in like three years, so he may not even be using it anymore. But if he ever does, I will for sure post a second video with me interviewing him. After finding Wayne Doe, I also stumbled upon Caitlin Brown, aka Sergeant Swift Stitch, who does the same thing and is also a part of the Cosplay Corp, which is an organization that offers free repairs to cosplayers around the world. I provide a free cosplay repair service to anybody who needs it. Um, they call me or find me and I do whatever I can to fix up whatever is broken and get them on their way. There you go. Thank you, you so also, much. You're so welcome. Have a good rest of your con. Thanks, you too. And I spend my day uh, kind of roaming the halls um, with, the, with the sign on my back. Uh, and that kind of lets people know that I'm here. And then for everybody who's seen my information on social media, they can call me for repairs or text me for repairs. Hi, are you, are you calling for cosplay repair? All right, and where are you? All right, let's go back this way, let's go back that way. Something small like a rip in their dress or a broken prop can ruin somebody's day. It's no fun anymore. So for me, if I can make somebody be able to get back on the floor and go get that exclusive that they wanted or go get their picture taken and they've got a smile on their face, that's all that matters. You are amazing. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> The International Cosplay Corps was originally started five years ago um, uh, by a man that goes by Captain Patchett. He started it as a joke, sort of. He wore a Captain America sewing mashup costume and he found that people actually needed the supplies he was wearing as part of his costume. At our peak, we had over a hundred members in six countries. That I know of, I'm one of the only people on the West Coast. Anyways, that's all I have for you all today. I know this video was a little bit shorter than usual. I hope that doesn't bother anybody. But as always, if you liked, leave a like. If you didn't, leave a dislike. Comment if you'd like. And thank you for watching.